Scales and sizes in Construction Notes Manager are controlled by the dimension variables or dimension style. So if we put in a dimension, we should expect that CNM would be the same size. Here's a dimension. I put this text in at one tenth inch high and it looks like my current text arrow size is a tenth and text size is a tenth. Okay, so if I put in a bubble note, I would expect it to be similar. If I change that, I will uh, make the text, let's make just the text size bigger. Let's make it 0.2. And then if I put in a bubble note, it should be bigger. Now that's pretty simple, but some companies want their they want special sizes for maybe their tables and their bubble notes. So what you can do for that is go into CNM options and put in a name for the DIM style for bubble notes and for tables. And I guess I'll call one Tom, B Tom, and the other T Tom. And if they exist, CNM will use them. And so I'll go into my dimensions and I'll say new BTOM and new, and let's say BTOM, the bubbles we want to be smaller than usual. And I guess I should make the uh, arrows uh, proportional. So 0.05, and then we'll have TTOM be uh, t bigger than usual, 0.3 and 0.3. We'll make a BTOM point, where's text, 0.3, okay. All right, so we've got Copy a BTOM, we'll call it TTOM. So I guess our tables are going to be really big and our bubble notes are going to be really small. So if I put in a bubble note, it's half as big as that Gettysburg address. And if I put in a keynotes table, I, it's big, big, big. Okay. That's good. All right. And that's all you have to do. Thanks for watching.